Hey girl. Hi, pool guy. Hi. I bought a new one and a half horsepower Hayward Super Pump. I was a complete bonehead. I hooked up the electricity and turned it on for just a split second to test it out. However, then I got distracted. I forgot to flip the breaker back off. Eventually, my timer turned the thing back on overnight and it ran for about 24 hours dry. I've opened my pool now. I flipped it on to see if everything still worked. The pump primed and pushed water without any issues. However, it started smoking really bad, so I quickly flipped the breaker back off and disconnected the pump. Would something like a bad shaft seal cause smoking, or does this sound more internal? The smoke does appear to be coming from where the wet end connects to the motor. It seemed like the motor was running fine, meaning no weird noises and running as powerful as could be. The long and short of that answer is you are in fact correct. It is the mechanical seal. There are two pieces of ceramic that spin together on that shaft that prevents the water from running back into the pump itself. What I've known to happen over time is by running dry like that for a period of time, everything starts heating up and although it never reached critical point, critical heat in the motor because there is a cutoff, a thermal cutoff that will cut off the motor itself if it gets too hot, but what you might find long term, no real damage other than maybe you damage the mechanical seal, you may want to replace that right away, it'll make it a whole lot uh, better for you, although you may have shortened the life of the motor slightly. Now, uh, likely not too bad. What I would suggest also though is eventually you're going to see some leaks in your plumbing. Likely what happens when a super pump runs dry is where your male adapter threads into the bottom, top of the pump itself. If you pull that out, if you can cut it apart and pull it apart, you'll notice that likely instead of it being straight up and down threads, they've coned in a little bit. And that's just because of heat in the pump itself, uh, heat in that motor area. So it's not really gonna hurt the motor so much as it's gonna hurt some of the mechanical parts. The plumbing, you may have compromised, and you may have shortened the life of the pump a little bit, but it's really not the end of the world, you're okay.